My name is Jay. I'm 18. Uh, I live in Coolville, Ohio, and my life revolves around rock and roll. I've learned quite a bit just watching um, how they set up the mics, uh, how they mix the tracks through to make it make everything sound even enough to where you can hear everything. Um, it's really it's just it's so much, I just feel like it's so much fun just just to be basically stand there in front of everybody watching them do stuff. Like I could I could care less if I didn't throw down tracks, to, to be honest, because I could. Just watching, I, I, I learn, I've always learned by seeing and hearing music, mu music, learn by just sitting, listening to a CD player, trying to figure out what they've been playing, and just keep doing it and doing it and doing it and doing it until I get it. And same with recording. Uh, I've, I've sat down in that studio so many times with just a guitar in my hand, playing it, and having tried to do some leads over top of it. To, and recording both of them and mixing them to make them sound good and just trying different ways to do everything. And miking, how have positions of mics on my drum kit and just everything. So it's just really, it's, it's the best experience ever to be here. So, and I hope I can do this in the fall. You want to go to college because you want to learn how to produce rock music because that's something you're really passionate about. You know, and again, you may need to take some math and English classes to get there. But there's going to be a reason that you walk in the door every day to college, and we want to show them what that reason is, you know, that they're pursuing something that they're passionate about. I was coming here with, in my head, that I was playing on, I was just get down busy and learn my stuff, learn my, uh, all I can, um, just stay focused on that. But it turned out I was able to focus on that and make friends, and uh, I knew nobody when I came here, and I got this, some pretty cool dudes in there, and the, recording studio, really fun guys to hang with, so. Ah, just, I've been basically just chilling with new friends, new people I've met, Jordan and Kyle. Basically, just, we'd, we'd sit up in the room, we'd talk, have, have laughs, it's all, because we're just, uh, Jordan, he's a pretty sweet drummer, he's, he's better, he, I, I feel like he's better than I am, and that just kind of helps me, you know, want to push to be, to keep going. And Kyle, he's just, he's, He's definitely, he's really cool. We just, uh, we connect a lot. It's um, like playing guitar, being both uh, classic rock fans with the guitar. Um, he'd start playing something and I'd, you know, watch him and, you know, try to figure, try to figure it out. And then I'd get it and then, you know, bust out some, trying to sell this stuff. And, and like, I'd, I'd start playing it again and then so he can do it. So it's like we're trading back and forth and we're giving us each other ideas. And it's really, that's really cool. At the Rock and Roll Camp, we are exposing um, high school students to the variety of different stages of making music. Um, some of them have played music with other people, some of them have been playing music for a while, some of them just started two months ago playing guitar. So we're taking all these different people, push, putting them together in bands, and writing and recording original music. First thing they're going to get to take away is a CD of the music they made. They made music on their own, and now they've made music with the group. So they'll actually have something concrete. They'll have a band name, they'll have a band shirt, they'll have a logo, they'll have a MySpace page. So there's all that. And then just the joy of playing music with other people who are like themselves as far as wanting to enjoy music and maybe not sure where to take their hobby as far as should I be in a band, am I good enough to be in a band, and I'm saying you are. I don't care if you've been playing two months. If you want to play a slow song, strum slow. If you want to play a fast song, just strum fast. You'll be fine. That's it. There's nothing to it. It's not rocket science. This is rock and roll. Oh, Neil's really cool. Um, he's just one of the guys I can see me relating to um, with his studio. It's just, it's, it's pretty sweet. <laughs> like, I like it a lot. It's just all this stuff is up to date top stuff and that's like I'm, I'm, I'm trying to take notes in my head to be able to figure out how, what I want my studio to look like and how I'm gonna be able to build that when I if I can get a studio of my own someday. I came to camp to learn to record so it's basically like it seems how I feel like I want to go here in the fall to the music program here at Hawking College, and um, this 
camp feels like a pre-class to me uh, through the recording, learning how to record, uh, setting up uh, if we're going to be able to, if he's going to teach us to set up where to set up mics, how to have sound checks to do that. So it's just all like a pre-class for my future um, references towards college in, in the fall.